Sketching the floor boundary, structural and floor slab edges. If we want to put a structural floor in, a structural floor is one in which it will transfer loads of the building and it will be part of the analysis of the whole structural analysis. So all the moments will be transferred down. And so it will, we want to put a structural floor in. If we want to do such a thing, uh, we come over here to floor and we go to floor structural. We put it in just like we normally would, except this allows the structural engineer to do all the analysis of the floor uh, combined with you know, the, the foundation, etc. Or maybe it's beams and columns. Also, we can put in a, an architectural floor which has a slab edge. So, uh, the slab edge is sometimes known as a monolithic edge or a thickened slab edge. Um, in this case, we build the building on perfect soil such as sand. And if so, then we can have no foundation and we can have a thicker edge around the, uh, the building where the walls are and that will hold up our building. Uh, so to do so, we come over here and we s basically, we're going to go up here and I can see, I like to work in this 3D view, I can see the floor here, I got the wall hidden here temporarily. I go up the floor, I go to floor slab edge, and yada yada yada. Um, I now, I got my slab thickening edge here, and when I come up and I pick on this bottom edge, I want to pick on that bottom edge of the floor, I pick on it, you'll see that it thickened up that edge of the, of the, of the floor for me. So I got one edge in there thickened up and I can do that to all four sides and I end up with a, uh, a slab edge thickened or a monolithic, monolithic uh, slab uh, at this point. So uh, we do that by selecting the bottom edge of the floor uh, and we get a slab edge to our floor.